What's happening, fam? L.A. Y'all Movement Still Moving. The book is entitled Lessons from a Non-Custodial Father at Amazon, Kindle, and Create Space. Link will be in the description box below as usual. Go get it. PayPal link there also. They asked me to put it up, so I put it up. Thanks, everybody, for supporting. Video, though. This video is entitled You Played Yourself by Playing Them. We think about people getting played. And how they're suckers and how they're stupid and how they're dumb and they should have saw it coming. But we don't never talk about the people who played them and how those stories normally end. And how the stories normally end is this person saw an opportunity. They played another person and they played on whatever it was, whether they be them being naive, whether them being... And love whether them not knowing that this person had ill intentions and they befriended him or something like that. Um, but so in essence, they met a person who let their guard down, and you and they got sucker punched. And people jump on a person who got sucker punched. But everybody pay, plays the fool sometimes. Ain't no exception to the rule. Oh, oh, lyrics. Now, what ends up happening is this. We don't ever talk about what happens on the interim. You know, the person that 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 that, that celebrates playing a person, what winds up happening? They fall out with the person that they played. Now they got to move on and try to play somebody else. And what happens? They may play that next person, and then they'll fall out with that person. And then what happens? Then they have a... A, a, a routine of looking for people to play. But then as time goes by, there are less and less people to play and they have nothing to show for it. See, the people who get played lose when they get played. The people that play people never have anything to show for it for getting played because they're like, a, they're like um, gypsies. They're just traveling around and around playing people, but they never set up shop anywhere. They never really have a, 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 um, a castle to, to call home, you know, a place to call home. They never built themselves anything. Their foundation is always, you know, moving pillar to post, you know, robbing Peter to pay Paul. But Peter and Paul have a place to stay. They don't. The other thing about it is, you know, when you play a person, you you assume that they could take a loss compared to you. You know, you're going to come up by playing them and they're going to take a loss. But a lot of times people who play people think that other people can take that loss. Oh, they, they ain't nothing. They, you know, just like when you owe somebody, somebody gives you money and you owe it and then you don't show up. Oh, they, 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 they look such and such money ain't going to mean nothing. It means something. But you look at that person like they can get their money back. But that money doesn't say something. You taking that money from them doesn't say anything about them. It says something about you. So you played yourself, you know, by playing them. Because what winds up happening is it's a small world. Um, you're going to wind up doubling and tripling back to people who you played because you ran out of people to play. And then what happens? You got nowhere to go. You know, you played yourself because now you got to rely on your own. Um, you got to rely on a skill that you didn't actually cultivate, which was getting it the hard way, earning it, you know, working for it, doing the right thing to get ahead. You didn't do that. So because you wanted to get it easy, Easy way was playing people. Let other people do all the heavy lifting and you swoop in at the end with a, look over there. I got it. I'm gone. See, I played you. You should have never looked. That type of thing. Problem. You know, the same thing that goes with, with um, you know, people in the relationship uh, market. You go around playing people, you're going to play yourself because you're going to look crazy. Like, there's some people who play all the people in their city and then their name gets around the city. Nobody messes with them. 
or nobody takes them seriously. So when they want to be taken seriously, the reputation of, of using people precedes them. You know, um, if, if you go around playing people and you moving and moving and moving, you move from one city to the next, to the next, to the next, people are going to look at you crazy because after a certain age, you haven't, you haven't settled down for yourself. So you always need somebody to do something for you. And, you know, when you hit a certain age, people look at you like, what? How come you don't even have the basics together? And they've realized, oh, because you've been playing. You've been playing games and playing people and playing so long, you played yourself. Now you got nothing to show for it. You don't have a place to lay your head. You don't have, a, you don't have enough money to get you through the night. You don't have any friends or family to call to help you in the jam because you played them all. So now you're looking up, you, you, you're at the mercy of complete strangers. And then some of y'all get mad because some people see you as you are as an opportunist. And then they capitalize on you being down on your luck. And you get back what you put out with other people from other people you, uh, who, who are playing you now because they know you play everybody else. Now they meet you, you know, where you are as a person, you know, ethically or morally, and now you played yourself because guess what? Now you can you you know how to play ball in this unethical way because that's the only ball you've ever played. And then, you know, you wish it wasn't like that, but that's out of your control. You played yourself by playing them. You know? Sometimes people see an opportunity and they take it. And they, you may stab somebody in the back. And you might stab a person in the back and go on to do bigger and better things. And you forget about that person. But you might have saved, you know, now you, you thought that was a good move. You know, you, 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 you're swimming with the sharks. But guess what? <laughs> you're swimming with the sharks. So those you're hanging around sharks. And maybe you just don't have the heart to be a shark. Maybe you just don't have the temperament to be a shark 24-7. You know, baby shark, do 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 Maybe you ain't grown. You're just a baby. Maybe, just maybe. So n now you're in the, in the atmosphere that you, you know, um, fight, you know, uh, bite, scratch, and claw to get into with all the sharks, and now eh, the water's a little too, too cold, you know, the sharks are a little too aggressive, you know, you can't, you can't show any, any um, weakness or vulnerability because they're going to eat you for lunch, so you got a head, but how you going, you don't know how you're going to survive, or you don't know how long you'll be able to survive under the circumstances. And then sometimes you stab somebody in the back and you get ahead and you give them the space and opportunity to bounce back because you, you, you think they're done, they're finished, and they, they rise higher than you. And then what? You know, oh, I know them. We cool. No, you're not. No, you're not. You played yourself because now they're not going to rock with you. Nah, uh, yeah, I know them. Yeah, they... they they did X, Y, and Z, and I ain't been rocking with them since. Because the person that you that you played might have a great reputation, and you, yours is uh, shaky. And people might take their word over yours. You know? And this is what happens when you play people, you might wind up playing yourself. You know, sometimes people overextend themselves to help you, and you take their help and you use them, and then what winds up happening when you use them? You know? <laughs> you use them up, right? But they have the, the 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 life force to keep coming back over and over and over again. You just have the life force to jump on an opportunity by using a person, but you have nothing to back that up. See, they throwing their their ideas are the crumbs that they're throwing out right now. They're trying to get rid of get rid of all the scavengers before they actually put the bread on the table. So you went for the for the crumbs, and now 
You know, all of you, all you rats and snakes, y'all full, y'all feasted, y'all like, ah, they done. Yeah, like, good. I know who all y'all is. Now I can put this bread on the table and I'm about to break bread with real people. And then it's like, oh my God. You know, I'm sorry. No, you're not. It's, it's okay. So, you know, sometimes we got to think about it that, you know, some people out here who, who get a kick out of playing people, you know, a lot of times they ultimately play themselves. You know, but we don't. We only talk about the people who get played, not the people who play themselves by playing people. Wow, say that three times. Anyways, like, share, subscribe. Catch y'all on the next one. Peace.